Me, a Wahab Riaz and Liam Dawson. So these are the last two that were short of a length, and it's not a bad length to pick up. Well, that was the last one, but he's bowled very well. He got those two bang bang wickets up front. What about this? Look at Darren Sammy hopping to first slip. Maybe he'll bowl the last over Wilco. Not on one leg, he's not. Well, he won't have a run up. <laughs> he's not. He's, he's a man, he's a hero. That's not going to happen tonight. But clearly, Slats, you're in harmony with Darren Sammy because this is what they're going to do. It's very rare throughout the whole PSL, and every time he comes on and bowls at the end, we know how hard it is for the batting to get him away. So he's every chance of honing in and getting two wickets here. Pereira on strike. Squeezes it out. We've got to keep him at the non-striker, and they've done that. Right, now, Amwar Ali has used up six deliveries for three. Yeah, he's got to keep his eyes on the ball. He's just swinging widely. Must make contact, even if he doesn't get a boundary. He must seek to get a single at the very least. You know what, fellas? A couple of years ago, Amwar Ali scored 46 of just 17 to win a T20i for Pakistan in Colombo. He's got to somehow program that batting mode in his head now. Can he do it? Can he repeat it? Yeah, he's probably thinking about it, channeling it. Come back to me, come back to me. <laughs> I have done it. But you only know that, you, you know, if you've done it once, he gets one away. Well, he's going to get one, and he's quite happy to take one and not even think of a second. Yeah, choosing the wrong options. Not getting it off the middle of the bat. Fine leg was up. You need a, a little bit of innovation sometimes when you're not getting your power shots. It's probably better to be innovative. Maybe the, the ramp shot, the paddle sweep. Well, Pereira's favorite area is to go over mid wicket. But I don't think I don't think we'll have Riaz is going to give him any anything for him to look at mid wicket. He is so strong over there. There he is, he's looking for it mid-wicket, and he finds the fielder. It is Chris Jordan who's on as a substitute, and he takes the catch. Well, there he goes, he gets to smooth out that mo, exactly what he wanted to do. That's why he had to bowl, and it is the dangerous pair. They're starting to feel the victory, they're starting to feel good about it. They're getting the job done. Always felt like it was going to be a close one. Geez, nearly misjudged that. <laughs> he just gets there, and there he is. Cool and cool moment. Not good for Quetta. He's gone for 12, 1, 3, 2, for 7. Hassan Khan has been a hero for Quetta in this HBL PSL. He smashed the fifth ball of the 20th over against Multan for a six in Dubai. He won the match for them, and Viv Richards squeezed the life out of him when he finished. Now, Viv has been in pensive mood throughout this innings. 26 required from nine. So in the body language you've seen the dugouts, who's believing and who isn't believing? You can read it, can't we? Here we go. Amorali, he's feathered that. That's all it is. It's one. And he's been choosing the same option over and over again. Not getting the result. 
Same with Tassara Pereira. Looking to tug this one to leg when he should be looking to hit it over cover. That would have been an easier option, but that's a strong area. Sometimes you need to choose different options when things are not going your way. See how low the hands were on the big thing? I mean, just one step to the ball, but, <laughs> but it got there. He judged it perfectly in the end. It was nicely taken. Can this youngster, can this youngster produce the goods for Quetta? It's asking so much. He's got him straight away, Hassan Khan, he perishes, and the moustache gets a stroking. Yeah, it's been good play, good tactics, good bowling. It's uh, been so difficult for the batsman against Rios, right through HBL. PSL, just the fact that he's accurate, he gets the leaps right. We've seen a lot of that, haven't we? He's a master performer when the pressure's on. One, three, three, four, eight. Mir Hamza, and he comes in with Quetta facing defeat. Yeah, 25 of seven, and they're having to contend with one of the best in the business in the world, Wahab Riaz. Well, the intent was good, just didn't get enough bat on it. Carried through to Cameron Akmal, who made no mistake. Darren Sami, fists folded, clenched. He knows he's got this game. Of course, it's the repeat of last year's final here, where Quetta came runner-up to Zalmi. Last ball of the 19th. It's brilliantly bowled. Well done, Wahab Riaz. He finishes for two for 26. One over to go, and Quetta need 25. Liam Dawson was the hero with the bat for Zalmi. And Anwar Ali just staring into the abyss here because he's been swinging away without much success. Five he's got from eight. Quetany 25. Liam Dawson scored 62 for Zalmi. He was the glue that held them together. And now he's going to bowl this last over. Will he bowl Zalmi to a win? Hard to win for the batting side from here, but how quick do you reckon Dawson's going to get him in there? <laughs> he's probably going to be bowling 115. But uh, I'm not sure you'll see too much flight from him. I think he'll be fairly relaxed. It's a massive over to, for quite a win, but still, first two balls. These first two are crucial. Yeah, plenty of runs to defend. 25 required. That's going to take some doing. 
Oh, Gladiator's gonna get over the line. First Tw delivery. Uh, that uh, has just gone past a limping Darren Sammy. No chance of cutting it off, but he's gonna get four. Dawson's not happy. Well, he can't hop that fast. That's the thing. He's sort of got himself in a position where he's hiding very fine, and the big fella, he really is on one leg. Dawson, he's had a crack at the skip, but he just can't move. Trying his best. Not a bad start. Four from the first ball. 21 now. Well, he's gone back. It's a big six. Quetta are not done yet. Well, it's do or die situation. It's the ideal situation for a hero. Can Anwar Ali be the hero tonight? Two boundaries. Look at this. Good use of the feet. He's been looking for the boundaries throughout his innings. He gets it. Desperate. Now, Liam Dawson. He batted magnificently. He got 62. If he goes for another six here, he'll very quickly go from boy wonder to boy blunder. Super over. Did you whisper super over? Super over. 15 from four. Oh, he's got an inside edge and he won't go for the run. Yeah, it's a big ball, isn't it? And I just think of that first ball. Get a guy get under that catch it changes it there you go four six that ball that's a big miss yeah, he just lost his shape there aiming too much leg side rather than straight three balls to go it's gone big that's another big six get out of this ground salmi cannot look but Dawson, it's reality and it's happening. Oh, it's all part of the script, Longo. Down to the wire. Nine off two. They still need another six in there. Needs to pop one like that. I don't think you can stop him at the moment. So hard to chase these, but there is a chance. Stand and applause this effort. Anwar Ali still keeping the hopes of his team alive. If he hits two fours, we got a super over. Nine required, two balls. He's hit it, he's got it! It's six! My goodness! Unbelievable stuff here, Dawson! He thought he was safe, he thought there were too many to chase in the final over. Now they're believing. They need three to win. Three to win. What are you bowl? Look at his eyes. Two runs will mean a super over. He has cracked 22 so far in the over. Still one delivery left. It can go anywhere now. Let's go back to that first ball. Lobs up, skipper can't hop under it. That's a crucial moment. And you talked about he was going to fire it in at 115. He hasn't been doing that. This over, 4-6, six, dot, 6-6. Six, six. Wilco, the pressure is so heavily on Dawson now. If he bowled a wide or so, it would not surprise me. I mean, he's trying not to second-guess what this plan is. He's now got it in his head, but the pressure. Look at him, he's twitching. Three to win the match. Two for a super over. Dawson. Every eye in the house is on Dawson. Three required. Nice shot. It's short. It's oh, it's a drop. They have to run. They have to run. He's gone. He's run out, and it's a win for Zalmi by one run. One run in this match, and Zalmi have won it. A magnificent contest at the end, and Quetta will be absolutely on their knees. With fair thought for Anwar Ali, he's done a really good job. It was almost there for the taking. Unbelievable cricket match, as good as it gets in T20 cricket. They hug each other because emotions run high.
could have gone anywhere off the last ball. What an opportunity for a super over. But the Zalmi, they go on to win by one run. What a cricket match. Well, we're taking a breath, aren't we? It's just been phenomenal. There's been ups and downs. Quetta for me for a long time in that run chase were in control. And then it was two very quick wickets that changed it again. And then I just thought there was too many to get in that last over. What an incredible finish to this match. The tension and uh, there is going to be strong celebration. Anwar Ali finishes 28 from 14, strike rate of 200, and he swung and he missed early on. And then that final over, which went for 23 and the very last ball. He found the fielder. Can you believe that that final catch was dropped? And I almost, I almost thought he bumped it onto the rope too. So it was, that was, and then, I, well, they're going to complete two, but they didn't. Yeah, I thought that you know, they didn't really have the sharpness of mind to look for the second run. They should have gone for it. This crowd cannot believe what has just happened. Amor Ali went for the last ball, looking for another six. Umid Asif drops 